Well, here we are, uh, first weekend in August, and uh, the garden is just exploded with uh, all sorts of good stuff. My common malign is uh, starting to go to seed. It really uh, is pretty high this year, pretty much over six feet. Uh, we're going to come around to the uh, Jerusalem artichokes. And boy, they are still growing and no flowers yet. So I'm expecting a lot of fruit, if you will, from them. We picked a number of pumpkins. About a half a dozen so far. I try to keep ways open in the garden. The weeds uh, this time of year are on you all the time. Yep, look at them babies. They're up about six, seven, eight feet. Beautiful looking. Here's the Bite Me Bake Off flag. Flies proudly. We're in the pumpkin patch here. And uh, they're doing quite well. And I uh, know it's late in the year and it's, I should be picking beans already, but the uh, pole beans finally made it up the pole and all the way up into the uh, owl and they'll be coming across soon. Peppers. Best peppers in years. Beautiful cayenne. Look how long they are. Huge. I got the uh, the bell peppers. Look at them babies. Nice size. Nice texture. Plenty of them. I got the best pepper crop I've had in years. And uh, they're everywhere. It's another nice big one right there. Right in there. A couple of nice ones. Look at them. Those are reds and whatever. And they got the flowers, tons of flowers. I got issues this year with the uh, squirrels eating my tomatoes. And uh, I don't know, I'm less inclined to declare out, all out war against them. As yeah, they're only trying to survive too. Anyway, Father Time is buried here. And. You'll have to excuse the robins. They think this is their outhouse. We're starting to gather potatoes. Uh, today I was in deep in the squash. And uh, we're in uh, the jungle, the mighty jungle here. And uh, these are potatoes right here in front of me. Look at that, how high they are, four feet. The uh, raspberries are going to come out to the second crop soon. I took about uh, 15 summer squash, a couple of zucchini, and uh, potatoes coming every day now. Not to mention uh, a few carrots here and there. Matter of fact, what do we got? That's, ooh. That's sort of a multi-tiered carrot, but uh, nonetheless, we'll take it. Plenty of uh, onions still in the ground here. Gonna take a little tour. Going through the summer squash. Oh, there's tons of them in there. There's a million little ones like that. The flowers, I thought of uh, eating the flowers this year. People tell me to do that, but they haven't so far. And we're heading through.
Yeah. I don't want to step on anything bad here. Raspberries are uh, getting ready to uh, do something with the second crop and then we'll cut these back and uh, we'll let them branch off for next year. The uh, end of the sack potatoes are doing great. I haven't pulled uh, too many of them out yet, but the uh, raspberries are great. The uh, milkweeds are just six feet tall here. And uh, I'll tell you something, the whole garden has been looking pretty nice. I got uh, lots of grass. Thanks to Cricket Marie. But uh, flowers come through here. And I got all my little blue flowers and red flowers and all sorts of things. I love my plants, love my flowers. Yeah. Still plenty of uh, Queen Anne's lace. Oh, look, there's Mr. Skinny now. I think the mirror makes me even look better. But, uh, hey, what are you going to do? Plenty of butternut squash. The monarch butterflies have been in here laying eggs, hoping to find some of them. Oh, I think I'm going to escape this way. Out through the flower patch. Oh, don't step on any. Oh, oh. All right. It was a tough go around. Yeah, it is my mirror. Love mirrors around the place. Though I did have a robin fly into it today. Though he just sort of dusted it. The potato patch is overgrown with weeds now and it's time for the harvest to uh, start. And we've actually pulled out a number of um, good potatoes out of here. And it looks like the uh, White moths has got to this side of the uh, garden and uh, it's going to cause some of my uh, butternut squash to be harvested early, but that's all right. This year the, uh, the pile has expanded out. Man, I'll tell you. I took tons of vegetation out this year. Here's my uh, red hollyhocks. They're beautiful. Some of the best I ever had. And the purple ones are magnificent, of course. I don't know why I say of course, but they're just such a good color. Butternut squash. Oh, they're in there. There's a couple of them there. Little nicks from the uh, rabbits or the squirrels. Um, man, I'll tell you. The hummingbirds have uh, been hanging around here all summer, which is nice. The uh, trumpet vine was in its glory this year. I don't know if it's the rain or whatever it is, but it's still doing well. And I'm gonna have to peel out some of the uh, ivy that I can't stand, but when the fall comes, we'll take care of that. I'm looking for uh, my monarchs to be laying eggs, and I'm pretty sure they have been. I just have to find the caterpillars. The uh, red ants have seemed to have retreated this year, and uh, that's a good thing. I 
Anyway, garden's been great. Yep. Yeah. Alright, coming out the back gate here and a quick uh, trip over to uh, the flower garden. And uh, this has been going pretty good. Butterfly bushes, all sorts of nice colored flowers, blues, reds, oranges even. A million different black-eyed Susans. Look at all these beautiful flowers. Yeah, all around. My zinnias, love zinnias. Yeah, roses. Yep, there's my mirror. Love my mirrors. We got a red shouldered hawk. Been uh, calling. Maybe I'll get a shot of him at the tail end of this video. But anyway, midsummer. Yes.